Hello, future students of Atsaxion. So, we are Kali and Tim from Studio Right, located in the city center of Deventer. And we give a lot of uh, group sessions like uh, fitness, boxing, yoga. Uh, am I missing something? Yeah, we also teach uh, personal sessions like personal training, physiotherapy, uh, personal yoga as well. And today we made a, a sweaty workout session for you guys. Uh, yeah, so you can train on your intro week. Yes, and uh, if you like it... Uh, come join us, come maybe. Join us. Maybe yes. come, uh, come join our studio uh, for one session or something. Alright, enjoy. enjoy! Hello, and welcome to the warm-up. It's important that you uh, put some nice music on. So go to your Spotify and play some of your favorite music because you are going to need it. All right, first we're going to warm up. So uh, you can dribble with me in a nice tempo. We're gonna start easy and we'll make it harder and harder the further we go. All right, in the first 15 minutes I'm gonna do with you, I'm gonna use a lot of boxing and kicking, a lot of high intensity exercises so we will get all sweaty. Alright, pay attention because every time your right leg touches the ground, your right fist throws a punch. Alright. Make sure you time it good. So the step and the punch is at the same time. Right foot, right hand. Really good. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, you can continue dribbling. You already feel that that heart rate is going up. But you have to breathe faster. All right, we're gonna switch sides. So left, left, feet and fist at the same time. Boom, boom. All right, to make sure your other hand is near your chin. It's your guard, your protection. In boxing, keep going at a fast tempo. Boom, boom, five, four, three, two, one. All right, in a normal dribble. Slowly, you're getting warmer and warmer. And it's really necessary that you have some nice music on. So if you don't have that yet, make sure you put some music on. Alrighty, we're gonna do some front kicks like this. A high kick, a step in between, and then we switch sides. So we do a kick, step, 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 kick, step, 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 kick, step, 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 boom, 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 boom. Yes, feel the rhythm. High kicks. So after the kick, you do two steps back, one step forward, and then you throw the kick. Boom, 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 ha, boom, 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 ha. The higher your kick is, the warmer it gets, of course. And you really try to hit the belly or the chest of your opponent, maybe the head even, if you're really flexible. So make sure you go high, kick, boom. Kick, boom. Make sure you kick with the bottom of your foot. So not your toes, but really the bottom of the foot. All right, both sides once more. Last one. And we're gonna do some dribbling again. Awesome. Shoulders are relaxed. They bounce a little bit. Really, really good. Alright, we're gonna do some high knees. So we stand like this, the feet are white, and the heads go up in one corner, and then the knee goes toward both the hands. And we're gonna do it with the same side again. So knee, boom, knee, boom. Alright, it's really like you're dragging someone down to watch your knee. Make sure you exhale when you give that knee. Knee. Knee, ha, 
five, four, three, two, come on. One more. All right. Feet apart again. We go to the other corner with our hands and we throw the other knee. Let's do this. Boom, down, boom, down, boom. All right, that is really, really good. It's important that you follow your own tempo. If I go too fast, you can do it slower. If I go too slow, make sure you do it faster. Five, hop, four, hop, three, two, come on, last one. All right, then we're gonna start dribbling again. So, first part of this workout, like I already told you, is 15 minutes of high intensity with a lot of boxing and kicking. So we're gonna sweat. Heart rate is really, really high in these first 15 minutes. Okay then, we're gonna do some jump squats. So the feet point to the, to the front, the knees go to the front as well. When you go down in your squat, you stay nice and straight with your upper body, and then you jump, and when you hit the floor again, you immediately Go down in your squat. All right, follow me. Jump squats. Jump high, land softly. I like it to swing my arms back when I'm jump and keep them to the front when I'm down. This is so hard on the legs. Five, four, three, come on, two. Last one. All right, well done. We're gonna do one more dribble. My heart rate is pretty high now, 140. All right, that's good. Okay, so when you're right-handed, your left leg is in front. When you're left-handed, your right leg is in front. Make sure you got that. Then the front leg is bent just a little bit. All right, put your guard high, so the uh, fists are near the chin. And what we are going to do is we're gonna throw first the arm, the same arm as your front foot, and then we're gonna throw the other arm. So jab, this, this is called the jab, and then across afterwards. So jab, cross, back, jab, cross, back, jab, cross, back. So when you're right-handed, your left arm goes first, when you're left-handed, your right arm goes first. Make sure you keep that rhythm. Boom, boom, ha, boom, boom, yes. All right, come on. Keep that tempo. Five, four, three, good, two, one. All right, really, really good. So, another combination. Still the same leg at the front, guard is high. So I'm gonna show you how you do it when you're a lefty. So we throw a right punch, then a left hook, then a right hook. All right, so when you're not a lefty, when you're right-handed, you do it all different. So the opposite as I'm showing. So left, sorry, right, Left hook, right hook, guard. Right, left hook, right hook, guard. Right, left hook, right hook, guard. Okay, when you got it, we go faster. Boom, like this. Boom, 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 guard. Boom, 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 guard. Come on, keep in the rhythm. Sa, 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 sa. Make sure you got it. If it goes too fast, you slow it down a little bit. Boom, hook, hook, straight, hook, hook. Come on, keep going. Yes, five, and four, three, come on. Two, ha, ha, one, ha, ha, sa, sa, sa. All right, really, really good. So make sure you've got a soft ground, maybe a yoga mat or something, something, maybe just a pillow, it's also good. 
because we're gonna do a sit up and when you're at the top, you throw a jab and a cross. And make sure you end that combination with your good hand. So when you're right handed, you start with your left. Boom, boom. Join me. Come on. We got five more minutes for this high intensity part of this awesome sweaty workout. Come on. Boom, boom. Yes. Come on, guard is near the chin again. We go down. And only when you throw a punch, your guard is down. Five more. Four. Come on, keep going. Two. Last one. All right, really, really good. Fast, stand up again. Because what we're going to do is we're going to do a dribble and every time a foot hits the ground, your same arm is going to throw a punch. Boom, boom. Yes. It's a bit like a hardcore dance. So punching and dribbling simultaneously. Pretty hard. Pretty hard for the coordination, of course. Try not to overthink it. It's the same as your first year in college. Don't try to overthink everything. Just go with the flow and do it. Boom, boom, boom. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, really, really good. So what we are going to, going to do, it's a little bit of a ninja exercise. So we're gonna make these rounds inwards to outwards. And we're gonna switch sides. You can join me, come. Boom. Make a really big circle with that knee. Keep your guard high, keep your hands high. And keep tension on that core. Really good, continue, come on. High. So, if you wanna make it harder, you can do it with a straight leg. It's way harder. It's also a really nice kick in kickboxing. In the MMA as well. Inwards to outward. Boom. Go high. A little bit of footwork in between. Five. Four. Three. Come on. Two. And last one. All right, really, really good. So what we are going to do is pretty, pretty difficult. It's the last thing from the high intensity part of this workout. So we are going to do this combination, the jab, cross, jab, cross. And we're gonna do it 10 times. When you did it 10 times, you do one burpee. And a burpee is belly on the ground, and then you jump with the hands above your head. So 10 times, jab, cross, jab, cross. You count it for yourself or you just join me in my tempo, and then one burpee. All right, we're gonna do it for two minutes, and then we're done with the high intensity part. Ready, three, two, one, let's go. Jab, cross, jab, cross. Follow your own tempo. You can also join me if you want to. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And then we do a burpee, so hands down, belly on the ground, get back up and jump. And again, one, two, three, four, come on, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Let's go, burpee time. Boom, one burpee, belly on the ground, and jump. And again, one, two, three, come on. So we burn a lot of calories with these high intensity boxing workouts. So make sure you keep burning calories also during college. All right, burpee, let's go. Hop, hop, hop. And again, boom, boom, boom. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, burpee, come on. Keep going. One more minute, boom, boom. This is the final part of the hit workout. Throw that punch nice and straight, straight forward. All right, burpee. Come on. 
Let's go. Let's go. Come on, look a little bit angry. You can throw nicer punches. Boom. Last one. And a burpee. We're almost there. 20 seconds remaining. Come on. Boom. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Jab, cross. Ha. Ha. Come on. Three, two, one, and the final burpee, belly on the ground, boom, back up, and jump. All right, awesome guys. Take a little break, so Kylie will help you out with the next part of the workout. You're going to do a lot of abs and a lot of lower body, and after that, I will be back with a nice little challenge. All right, enjoy. for your lower body. I'm gonna set the timer. First exercise. We're gonna do a squat into a leg raise. A squat and then the other side. There we go. One minute. Small squat and leg raise. Squat and then the other side. Okay. Nice and slow. And go down, maybe a little bit more. That's very good for your butt. Squat and leg raise. 20 seconds. Feel the tension in your legs, hips, butt. One, and the second exercise. We're gonna do a back lunge and a high knee, and then the other side. Back lunge and high knee. There you go, timer is on. In a back lunge, High knee, and then you go to the other side. Back lunge, high knee. Okay, there you go. Back lunge, high knee. Other side. Very good. And don't forget your breathing. Inhale, exhale. Twenty seconds. Very good. And ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. There you go. Third exercise. The grasshopper. You gotta lay down on your belly and everything goes up and down. Inhale up and exhale down. In three, two, one, and go. One minute. Up and down. Inhale, you go up and exhale, you go down. So follow your, your own breathing. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. And feel the tension in your lower back, your butt. Inhale and exhale. Almost there, 20 seconds. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. There you go. Fourth exercise. You're gonna lay on your back, and then you come in the bridge, hips up and down. In the bridge, 
and down. There we go again. One minute. You go up into the bridge and down. Up and down. Follow your inhale up and exhale down. And your focus is by the action, up, feel the tension and down, then slowly down, feel the tension and slowly down. Very good. 10 seconds. And five, four, Three, two, one, very good job. First round is done. A little bit rest, and then we go for second round. So uh, shake your legs and your arms. Maybe a little bit water. Okay, there we go, one minute. Second round, there you go. Small squats and leg raise. Other side, very good. Focus by the movement and feel the tension again. A little bit lower every time you make the movement. Twenty seconds. A little bit longer. Okay. Five, four, three, two, one. Very good. Shake, shake everything. Okay. Second movement. One minute to go. And there we go. Back lunge, high knee. And the other side, back lunge, high knee. Okay. Back lunge, high knee. Again, the focus. Breathe in and out a little bit slowly. Okay, okay. Ten, nine, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and there you go. Okay. Come down, lay to your belly. One minute again. There we go. Up and down. Up and down. Inhale, you go up and exhale, you go down. This is the grasshopper. <laughs> nice name. Also in yoga, it is the grasshopper. Then we do it a little bit slower. Inhale and exhale. Very good job. You're almost there. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. 
Okay. Last exercise of round two. Go lay down on your back. Okay, there we go. One minute. Come into the bridge and down with your hips. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. I feel the action. The most you go up with your hips. Inhale and exhale. Very good. And five, four, three, two, one. Okay, there you go. A little bit of rest. Shake your legs and your arms. We do the last round, the third round. Okay, I am ready. You are one minute. There we go. Small squats and leg raise. Small squats, leg raise. Go deeper and deeper. Maybe do you do something with your arms, a little bit of uh, boxing or a movement. Very good. 20 seconds. Boxing. It's more difficult for the focus. Five, four, three, two, one. Very good job. Okay. Are you ready for the back lunge and the high knees? One minute to go. There we go. Back lunge, high knee, and the other side. Back lunge, high knee. And feeling hot, hot, hot. Don't forget your breathing. 10 seconds. And five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Very good. Come lay down to your belly. A little bit of rest. Not too long. Okay, one minute. Into the grasshopper. Up and down. Feel the tension. Most tension is here. Maybe a little bit longer. 
Maybe three, two, one seconds. Down and again up. Five, four, three, two, one. Down and again. It's more difficult. More tension. Down and up. Very good. Down and up. Almost there. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Come lay down. Turn your back. We almost there. One minute, last minute to go. And there we go. Up into the bridge and slowly down. Up into the bridge and slowly down. Maybe a little bit longer into the bridge. Walking to the spot. It's more difficult. Also, more tension by the abs. Down and into the bridge. Very good. Nice and slowly. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one. Very, very good. <sighs> We're gonna do three exercises for your abs. Um, I set the timer, one minute action, 10 seconds rest, and that for three rounds. Uh, the first exercise is the plank. You come in this position, and it's important to uh, keep the uh, supporting hands under your shoulders and create length in the spine. Okay, there we go. One minute. Keep your hands nice and steady. And keep breathing. And if it's too hard, you can come in this position. Okay. Fifteen seconds. And ten, nine, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Exercise two. You come in this position and bring your knees outwards. You make a crunch. There we go. One minute. Keep the movement upward. You can focus on a spot above you. And you go up and down, up and down. Breathing. You're almost there. Ten seconds. And five, four, 
three, two, one. Okay. Exercise three. You come in this position. It is the boat. And you're holding it for one minute long. Okay, there we go. One minute. And start. Your shoulders are low. And also here creates a little bit of length in the spine. I feel that your abs are working. A very good exercise for your core. And keep breathing. Ten seconds left. And five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Round two. We're gonna do it all over again. One minute in the plank. There you go. The supporting hands are under the shoulders. And also now create length in the spine. Keep breathing. And for a more difficult movement, you can make this movement. Very good. Hold it for a little bit longer. 15 seconds left. Very good, 10. Hold it, hold it. Five, four, three, two, one. There you go. Okay. Now we do. The second movement, you lay down, knees that way, and one minute, crunches, nice and slowly, feel the tension here. Also now, pick a point above you. Keep breathing. Very good. You're almost there. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Very good. Exercise three. You come in the boat. One minute. There you go. You hold it, this position. Maybe your abs are shaking, that's a good sign. It means that you're on a good way and that, that there is tension. Ten seconds left. And five, four, three, two, one. Okay, very good. Okay. 
move your arms and your legs. We're going to do the last round. And exercise one is the plank. Okay, one minute in the plank. There we go. Hands, feet, legs into the spine. And breathe in and out. Keep your supporting hands nice, steady. You can make a movement if you want. It's more difficult. A little bit longer. Hold it, hold it. 10 seconds left. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, good. Exercise two. Move slowly. A little bit of rest. Come in this position. Knees are going that way. Okay, one minute to go. There you go. Crunches. Up and down. And keep the movement upward. Not to your knees, but that way. Very good. Feel the tension. It's very good for your core. For more power there. Okay, three, two, one. There you go. Come in the boat. Last time, one minute. There we go. And hold it. If you want more, come in this position. And this is Earthquake. <laughs> Your abs, your lower back. And keep breathing. You're almost there. 20 seconds. Very, very, very good. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, one. All right, awesome. So right now you're really, really sweaty and I'm gonna give you the final part of this workout. We're gonna do a little challenge, which of course is pretty hard. Otherwise it is not called a challenge. We're gonna do 10 exercises and we're gonna do them one minute and then a little bit of rest afterwards, maybe 15, 20 seconds. Let's see what the vibe is at the moment. Uh, our heart, in our heart exercises, so make sure you can do them all. So I will also give you some options. When it's too hard, you can still join me. All right, so we're gonna start with a normal push-up. Push-up on the toes, of course, is the hardest variation of the push-up. 
If it's too hard, you do it on the knees, then it's a little bit easier. And if it's still too hard, the glutes go backwards, so that you can do it like this, and then it's way easier. All right, are you ready for the first exercise? Push-ups in three, two, one, let's go. Push-ups, boom. Exhale, on the way up. Keep that abs strong, keep that abs tight. Come on, up. Make sure you go all the way down. So when it's too hard, knees down. And then you do your push up like this. Still exhale on the way up. Make sure your elbows go towards your body a little bit. So don't put your elbows all the way to the outside. That's not good for the shoulders. If it's still too hard, glutes backwards. Then you continue with your push ups. But if you're able to, on the toes, 10 more seconds. Six, five, four, last one. All right, a little bit of rest. Whew. All right, next exercise is for the calves. We're gonna do some calf raises, it's also balance. So you go high on the toes and then back on the ground. So make sure you don't touch the ground too long. So go up really fast in three, two, one, up, touch, up. It's just a little touch for a small amount of time. Come on and make sure you also make tension in both your glutes when you go up. Up. You really feel those calves. Come on, you're gonna need some right music for this. Make sure there's beat in it. Make sure that the music motivates you. Come on, up and up. Let's go. 15 seconds. I really feel them burning, those calves. Come on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one. All right, and shake those legs. So, what are we gonna do with a mountain climber? It's a pretty hard exercise. So, you're standing in the plank, which you did before with Kai, and then we gotta do some running like this. And the knees go under yourself, and your knees go towards your chin. Make sure you don't hit your chin, of course. All right, one minute in three, two, one. Let's go, mountain climbers, boom, boom. If it's too hard, your hips go up like this, and it's a little bit easier. But if you're able to stay low and lean forward, your shoulders have to go forward. If it's too hard, shoulders go backwards. Hips go up. Come on. 30 seconds. Boom. Come on. Keep going. Oh, yes. Yes, keep breathing. Strong. Oh, yeah. Knees go all the way to the chin. Almost there, five, four, three, two, one. All right, awesome, you really feel those shoulders burning as well, the abs, and it's a lot of conditioning, of course. All right, fourth exercise. So it's a pretty, pretty hard one, because we're gonna stand on one leg, and then knee up, and then we straighten the leg backwards. And you lean in with your upper body. All right, you got that? Because we're gonna do it. 30 seconds on each side. There we go, knee up. And then the leg goes backwards. Knee up. It's a lot of balance. And it's really hard. So you're gonna try to focus on one spot on the ground or on a wall maybe. Keep going. Use those arms, use those hands. Ooh, shaky. Last one. 
All right, immediately switch side, knee up, straight leg. Oh yes. Keep going. Yes. You really feel that leg where you're standing on. That leg is burning. When it's burning, you do really good. Up. Concentration, Tim. Almost there, last one. All right, really, really good. So, ab exercise. It's called bicycle crunches. So we put our hands just behind our ears, the feet go up, and we're gonna try and touch our left knee with the right elbow, and the other leg straightens. And then we're gonna switch side. So we're gonna touch in opposite direction. In three, two, one, let's go. And you're almost done. After this, I got one more exercise, and then we're gonna do some stretching, a little bit of yoga to cool down. All right, come on, straighten those legs, touch that knee, and of course, keep breathing strongly. Really good, come on, hang in there. It's a rough exercise, it's good for your whole abs, so the front abs, the high abs, the low abs, the side abs, even the deeper abs, we train them all with this fantastic exercise. Come on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Make sure you touch that knee with the elbow. 4, 3, 2, 1. All right, really good. One more exercise and then we're gonna stretch. All right, and at the last exercise, we did it before with the boxing is a burpee. I'm sorry for this, probably gonna hate me because of this, but we're gonna do belly on the ground and then jump with the hands high. And this is the final exercise, so don't quit now, we're gonna do this together. In three, two, one, let's go. Touch the ground, get back up, and jump. So make sure you make the motion with your legs. So you push your hands down, legs go backwards, and legs go to the front again, and then you jump. So no walking around with the hands or the arms. Make a motion with your legs. Come on, keep going. At your own tempo. Try to keep up with me. Maybe it's too fast, maybe it's too slow. I don't know. Come on, 15 seconds. This is the final exercise, so keep going. It's almost time for rest. Last one. Well, really good job. All right, and then we're gonna do some stretching. So first, we're gonna swing like this. Really gotta catch your breath now. Swing nice and slow. Those arms are totally relaxed. All right, come in the middle. Inhale, arms go up. You look up. And then a really big exhale, you go all the way down into the front fold. And you relax those shoulders. You come slowly up. The last part that comes up is your head. All right. Left hand comes in your side. Right hand comes up. You make a side bend. Make sure there's a little bit of tension on the abs so that you don't feel your lower back only. Nice side bend, you feel that stretch on the side of your body, the right side. Inhale, you come up. Exhale, we do a switch. 
Bend to that right side. I am really sweaty. I don't know how you are. I hope you're also sweaty and you enjoyed it. All right, slowly up. Then inhale, arms open, chest forward. Look up again. Feel that your chest opens. That there's a little bit of stretch on your abs. And on the exhale, the fingers go towards each other. Chin goes to the chest. Now this stretch in the lower back, in the middle of the back. Maybe the neck also. And get back in the middle again. All right, so the final is a stretch for the legs. Grab one foot behind you and hold it near your glute. The knees are near each other. You feel that stretch in your quads. Three, two, one. All right, we're gonna switch sides. Grab that other leg. Knees are near each other. Breathe nice and slow towards the belly, so try a low breathing. Three, two, one. All right, then you shake that whole body, shake it. Oh, that was a good session. Uh, we hope you liked it. Yeah, and we also hope that you think about us the next week because of the muscle soreness, of course. And maybe we should see you next time in the, the Red Studio. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.